Um, all right, we're going to start with TikTok. So this is the first thing. This is not the data, data dump. Uh, this is what was going on on TikTok. So uh, there was a lot of stuff that dropped today, and Johnny is getting kind of cocky. So here's Johnny with who I believe is Hank. I think this is Hank. So this is on TikTok. They went live today on TikTok. So Johnny is still going live, still trying to milk out clout and attention over this, uh, calling himself the OJ Simpson of Korea. Um, he's saying, I'm going to laugh like a maniac. And I'm going to, I'll go in the corner here. Uh, I'm going to laugh like a maniac when I beat the case like OJ. Hashtag Johnny Somali, hashtag Seoul, hashtag Korea, right? Uh, if, if this is the comments here, Trump is not saving your ass. And then Johnny says, I promise you, I won't step one foot in jail. So he is now telling the judge, I'm not going to jail. He is telling the judge, I'm not going to jail. What do you think that's going to, what do you think? Do you think that's smart, guys? Do you think that's smart to tell a judge, hey, I'm not going to jail. I'm not going to prison, right? Think that's smart? Nope. Nope. Um, we'll all be laughing when you end up in Korean prison like you deserve. Larry, fun fact, Trump invited Johnny to the White House. I'm going to post that next as Johnny. Okay, so the same at the police station, right? And then you've got this post. Right. Um, and this is stuff that once again, uh, has been put out there today. So Johnny Somali, um, this is from a little bit earlier, but you know, Johnny Somali has already called out Korean law enforcement. So he's saying he's not going to go into jail and he's already made statements like this. Japan number one. Okay. Korea number 50, maybe, you know, you know, you know, China, number one. America, Korea, uh, Israel, Israel, Korea, uh, you know what I mean? Y'all niggas ain't got nothing going on. Y'all niggas is weak as hell. Y'all Korean niggas is weak as I know Korea has never won a war. I know Korea is a defeatist country. You guys have lost every battle and every war you guys have been into. Uh, so you guys think you could win a war against the black? Uh, a little midget black man, a little green goblin, a little gold goblin, actually, from Diablo 4. So this is the first battle you guys think you can win. So I I, I understand your guys' sentiment. I understand why you guys... So he's, he's challenging them, right? Once again, I hope they, they're going to see all this stuff, you know? And, and the, the law enforcement's going to see this. So mad, you know, how about we make a peace? You know, you guys lost to so many countries in the past. So you guys think you can win against me? You're not going to win against me. Look, even Japan lost against me. And we know what Japan did to you. And Japan lost against me. So I am a very formidable enemy. So it's better for you Koreans to apologize to me. Instead of me apologizing to you, you Koreans should apologize to me. There it is. That's Johnny Somali's attitude, right? So for everybody's out there, and I hope all this is kind of put together, packaged, and translated. That's his attitude. He's gone into the police station today, and he's coming out with this attitude. He's coming out with this challenge, right? You know, and that challenge was from before. But once again, this is his attitude throughout. It's been consistent throughout his behavior. He does not think he is uh, touchable. He is defying the judge. He's spitting in the face of the judge. He's spitting in the face of the prosecutors. He thinks he's smarter than the prosecutors right? All this information is going to get to the prosecutors. You think they're going to take it easy on him? 